Hi everyone, I'm JD. Welcome back to my channel. So here is the last of the Glassine Bag Botanical Journals that I've done in this series. Uh, this one is slightly different to the others. This is the blue one, but it has a lot more of a eclectic page mix. So a few different colours um, and as you can see the cover is also different to the other botanical journals in that instead of having the lace on the spine part I put this white lace all the way around the front and the back covers as well so a bit more eclectic but because the front cover does have just this blue I went for with choosing ephemera as much as I could I chose blue and white ephemera and as you can see, yeah, the blue bulb pins with the blue lace on the side, all different types of lace. So there's all these flower charms and the leaves. Oh, am I in frame? <laughs> so in the front pocket, tying all that in, because there's not that many blue flowers, I did include purple as well to kind of cover that blue tone. But the blue and white is what I was mostly going for in this journal. So I like this because there's a rose here, such a pretty image to start it off with this beautiful white lace and then another rose here. So I'm kind of tying everything in with the roses on this front page. <laughs> and I love, I kept this blank because it's really cool how it has the words here and it's got that creamy texture tone to it. So we've got journaling card here. And I love this because it's actually a blue looking flower. <laughs> and I love this envelope. This is one of my favorite napkins to use. White flowers inside. So cool botanical pages in this one. Well, in all of them, but yeah. <laughs> Tuck spot here. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Love that paper. And this is, I love these paper bags, I've used them all now, but I really love this kind. If I see them, I will definitely get some. Stay Golden. Love this little, I just really do love the triangle tuck spots. Colour in, um, journal card. Um, here we have my pocket embellishment with the tag tuck spot here a tuck spot here, or a pocket, sorry, and a large pocket here with a tag. And I love these. Are these snowdrops? I just love how how pretty and delicate they look. I love this paper as well. So I was choosing all my favourite blue papers to go in this one. Love this. It says the gift of friendship on this side. It's like poems. And then here Look how striking that colour is, my goodness. Even that, that is so striking. Gorgeous. Oh, I love that. That is so pretty. And then I had to include this. Is that the snowdrop? It is so pretty. I love it. I have a thing for white flowers, I think. My favourite flower is the white lily. Not the, not that kind of lily. The, it looks like the tiger lily, but white. But I also love jasmine. And I love white roses. Out of all the roses, white is my favourite. And has been since I was a kid, really. I don't know why, but... Because white isn't my favourite colour. But when it comes to flowers, I really like white, it looks like. There's the fabric flip. Oh, love this little pocket here. So that's my favourite flower, pretty much. Except when it's all white. And I like the ones that don't have the coloured stamens. So it literally is just an all white flower. <laughs> Um, that, that one there, little tag, I love that paper by the way, really really love it, all little different elements, this is a journal card actually and it says adored, and a large large tag at the back, got my blue and white buttons here, and the cornflowers, oh my favourite picture, I was hoarding that one, <laughs> this is a um, botanical page from a diary or, or something. And a little tag here. One of my little tuck spots and yes it has the blue embellishment on top. 
with a blue piece of ephemera, little tags there. And this pattern paper, or embroidery paper, pamphlet type of page. Got that um, note paper again here. If I can get it out. <laughs> Not like last time where I stapled it. I will have to remember to fix that up with the other one. <laughs> And love this journal page card here. And a page with the blue and you'll be able to see it better on the other side. Another one of those pictures. Glued this down here, believe. Journaling space. There's the middle page. Love this image with the swans and the fountain. I have a thing for fountains. I really like fountains. Journaling card. So pretty. So there's the blue, I love it. <laughs> More note paper. I had to include this one because it had a blue and a white flower. So I was saving this for this particular journal. Ah, oh, so pretty and I was hoarding that though. <laughs> Another little tuck spot with those blue flowers. That, oh, that's one of some of my favourite paper, that one. Vellum page. And got a bit glue happy, it looks like. A um, pocket page with this striking, striking look at that. I don't know which way it goes. No, that way. Look at that blue, it's absolutely stunning. And some blue buttons, love it. This one's just kind of shiny. Ah, yes, that's kind of like my favourite flower kind of <laughs> there's a specific one I don't know what it is called but there's a large tag there one of those belly bands with note paper that opens out and this paper also opens out that same envelope with the note paper again Cute little flowers. <laughs> this is the one. Yay! Came out. So, note paper here. And again, love that paper. More white. I like how there's white flowers in the blue sky. So, there's the white and the blue already for the for me in that one. This says happy, gorgeous flowers. And you are fabulous. Don't forget it. <laughs> Another journal card here. And that's the one that's a colouring in postcard. Another fabric envelope with the lace. And really love that fabric. More of these gorgeous, gorgeous flowers. And some of that beautiful paper too, with a tag. So pretty. And that is the back, more of this beautiful, beautiful lace. And paired this image of the white and the blue, this nice scene. You can just picture yourself there. I love that door, that colour. Like a little cottage home with a garden cottage. I mean, cottage garden. <laughs> So pretty, and that is the blue journal. So it will also be in my Etsy Willowbound journals. The link will be below if anyone is interested. And yeah, that is finally my botanical series. So, so, so glad it's finally done. This was a long time in the making because I was working on these last year. So now I will move on to more projects. So this is all fun to get these ticked off finished projects. <laughs> anyway, let me know what you think and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.